Hey guys, a few days back I just started having trouble turning on my Kogan Agora 42 inch smart TV and when I just turn on, let me do it again, so turn it off and turn it on. So when I just turn it on, it was showing the loading page and then after it jump up to the Kogan logo page and it was staying for all time. So this was the problem I was facing and I was not able to use my TV at all. So I just contacted to the Kogan uh, support team and they said that there is something like software issue. So by just upgrading or updating your firmware will solve this issue. And I said, okay, so they just sent me the link and I downloaded the link in my laptop and then uh, I follow the steps. The steps are just make sure you transfer that uh, .bin firmware update file to your USB stick, but your USB stick must have to be updated, uh, formatted with FAT32. So I just format using FAT32 with quick select and that's it. And now I just transfer this firmware update dot bin file straight to USB make sure you don't make any folder and then transfer just transfer straight away in USB and then uh, safely remove so this is the USB in which I just transfer the dot bin updated firmware file and I will gonna plug it in to um, USB port 1 but before that maybe I would like to remove all that wires attached from my TV and just gonna attach this usb to usb drive one so let me find out which one is the usb drive one okay the bottom one is the usb drive one i gonna uh, let me do it i'm gonna just plug it in okay and then then just turn the tv off and now to format your tv or update your tv you will need the tv remote so just uh, use the tv remote and continue pressing volume plus key volume plus key and turn the tv on okay so i will continuously press volume plus key volume plus key and turn the tv on and continue pressing this volume plus key while tv is turning on and now it will come up with the search USB storage page and it will start upgrading software and make sure you do not turn your TV off and leave it updating and after sometimes this should finish and TV will automatically turn off and turn back on again and this problem will be solved I hope so let's have a look it might take some time during the time it upgrading the software, I just gonna quickly show you my parrots. Uh, I have lovely two beautiful parrots of Indian ringneck. One is a yellow one, that's a Michu boy, and the other one is a green one, that's a Charlie boy. I think they are a bit annoyed with this camera recording. They are just very lovely parrots. Oh, he, d he doesn't like camera recording, I think. So let me remove the camera from here and let go back to our business. And see, TV screen is already upgraded and it is turning on. Now, Kogan logo comes up again and we'll see what happens next. Finger cross. Oh, finally, it turned on after a long, long time. It took maybe somewhere around five minutes, so I didn't record it that part. And after five minutes, uh, it turned back on. And right now, it looks like everything is on place and everything is good to go. So that's it. I hope you enjoy watching this video. I hope I helped you somehow. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe my channel for more DIY fix videos in future. And if you somehow feel that I help you, then please like this video and share with your friends whoever is having Kogan TV. For today, that's it. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.